So we start where we left off. This is part 27. Now that the introductions are out of the way, listen to me, pal. I'm warning you. You being here puts me on the goddamn map. I have some information. Well, ain't you special? The problem is. I can't decrypt it, so I came to the source. Shit. Then you have put me on the goddamn map. We've been careful. We? Huh. Better give me a reason. Because that isn't making us the best of friends. Someone ordered a hit on me. It cost my niece her life. Whatever's in those files will lead me to them. I'm gonna find him with or without you. With you'd be a hell of a lot easier. Let's play make a deal. You think I'm in this dust bowl because of the uh, ambiance? Ever since them bastards terminated me, I've been trying to find a way back in. All I need is someone to drop some spyware inside their network. If it were that easy, you would have done it a long time ago. Hey, if it was fucking hard, I would have done it a long time ago. It's impossible for me to get at the perimeter without setting their damn alarms off. The place has my biometric profile. I got fillings in my head that sing to their security team direct. I can help you with that. But afterwards, you're gonna come with me to Chicago. Oh, am I now? <laughs> Follow me. Act three, hope is a sad thing. Continued. Nice place. You got a real eye for it. Now we must follow him. Bart? That there is a booby trap. And if you can't recognize one, then you ain't paranoid enough, friend. I have quite a few. And well, if you found me, then it's only a matter of time before others will too. So let's get started. Listen, I'm running on a limited time here. The faster we can get this out of the way. I don't think you understand your own conundrum, my friend. Chicago is running on software designed to find people. Now, I know how the CTOS thinks, because I'm her deadbeat daddy. And this she's still carrying in my picture in her back pocket. Now, unless you can clear my biometrics from the system, I am useless to you in Chicago. As far as my art, as you call it, if you fuck things up for me, I need to be ready for the fallout. Huh? Here. Let me show you. Ready? He has made some booby traps. Heads up! What's that? Well, hello! You feel that ground shake? Whoa! That set my spine straight. Give it a go! Attack it? Yeah! Ain't that something? Hey, if you blow your arm off, I'll sculpt you a new one. Your confidence is encouraging. Oh, I'm sorry. Am I here to boost your morale? Go, team, go. I think you misunderstand our relationship. I see an opportunity. You can help me, I can help you. I think you're missing the point. I found a sad drunk at Jed's bar toasting his glory days in private. I'm not an opportunity. I'm your second chance. <laughs> well, hell. I think I like you. But it don't make us friends. First thing I'm gonna need is some of Bloom's hardware. I've been out of the loop for a while. I need to figure out how their scanners work. You want me to break into Bloom? Not yet. Somebody else already stole the hardware. Inside job. Well, that stuff's big on the black market. I've scouted these guys. Let's just say 
They're big fans of the Second Amendment. Take one of my rifles. You're gonna need it. Swing by the gas station for me, will you? I got the Pawnee militia holding what's mine. So I need you to go in and grab me my truck. Now we must steal his truck back. So let's go. There's a bike. And we are here. That's a lot of guys. You sure don't make it easy, T-Bone. I need a closer look. And there's the truck. Disabling reinforcements. Another one. Oh, Let's go in. Take down. <gasps> nice. Oh no, there's a sniper on the water tank. Explode. Go and kill these guys. He's coming. Oh. Oh. Take down. Yeah. Let's quickly get rid of them. Let's go inside the shack. Inside my bed. There he is. Whoa, that blasted. Here comes another. He's down. Let's simply get away with the van. Pierce is here too. Call it in. Let's go. Arriba, arriba. Could this truck be any slower? Are you kidding? You actually got it? Yeah, I got it, but they're still on me. Oh, crap. Well, uh, what do we do? Force them off the road! Uh, what's that supposed to mean? I never expected you to actually get the damn truck. If you want the truck, you're gonna have to do better than that. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Bring them up next to the truck. No. We'll have a little round of art appreciation. Now we must make our way back to the plowing will do it. Hide out. Lead them around, pass my school. Oh no. It's wired already. You're a scary man, T Bone. Who blew that up? Now we must kill our militia members. Or escape. I killed him with his trap. Here it comes. Did that work? Yeah, someone died. Don't shoot me. Well, I have to do the work. 
It actually did kill someone. There you are. There's one more, and he's dead. The threat has been eliminated. Act 3, hope is a sad thing. Mission complete. The bunker's been making noise. What kind of noise? It's online. Some people have noticed. Script kiddies, mostly. Nothing to worry about. I'll make sure they stay out. We've been probed a few times. Probed? <laughs> there is only one that worries me. His name is Default, and he's very good. I'll watch him. Let me know if he becomes a problem. I think we got Wim and Kenny on our side now. All right, I left the truck for you. God damn, this plan might actually work. All right, now, you're gonna need security clearance to get inside Plume HQ. Have you ever chased a helicopter? And no, that is not a philosophical question. I've been chased by a few. What does that have to do with anything? Call it a hunch. We'll talk soon. Thank you for watching.